the weather outside is frightful, but the fire is so delightful. <laughs> Hi Puddin, the Mama Puddin here and welcome back to our channel. Here we do reviews, unboxings, and vlogs. Today I want to show you what we got our twin three-year-olds Andy and Yomi for Christmas this year. Now it's been a long year for everyone, including them, so I might have gone a little bit overboard for the holidays. This is by no means a brag video at all. I did a lot of planning and couponing to make this happen. If you want to know my methods for couponing and saving money, let me know in the comments and I'll make a video for you guys. But this is a holiday gift video. I will leave links below for everything that I could find and have broken everything up into groups for easier searching. Watch to the end to see the great big surprise. Let me know in the comments if you think you can guess what it is and no cheating. So let's get to it. My twins are fraternal, so I purchase things that they both like and things that they each have taken a separate interest in. Let's start with pretending play. First is the Melissa and Doug Scoop and Serve Ice Cream. They love to pretend to sell ice cream, so this was great. It has multiple flavors, cones, cups, and toppings. Perfect for shared play. Next we have the VTech Care For Me Learning Carrier. It teaches caring for others, plus features sounds, music, shapes, and colors. Here is the Play Circle by Batat Smart Cookie Chef's Apron and Accessory Kit. I actually bought two of these because baking is a personal passion of mine and I love it when they help. Alright, next up are the Fun of Princess Costume for Toddler Girls Fancy Dress Green with Accessories and the Padet Little Girls Princess Yellow Costume Off the Shoulder Dress with Accessories. Yomi is big into princesses, so a few new costumes were definitely in order. One is reminiscent of Frozen's Anna, the other of Disney's Belle, and they are too cute. Add on the Dress Up America's first princess accessories, because how can you be a proper princess if you don't accessorize? I mean, really. Who is your favorite princess? Leave a comment down below. Ah, the Doc McStuffins Disney Junior Get Better Baby CC. Of course, we love the cartoon, so this baby was an adorable no-brainer. Next, we have Super Wings, a show NZ loves. It's a cartoon about talking vehicles who travel the world. She has most of the two inch figures and really wanted Willy, which is the big submarine in this video. I couldn't find it, only on Alibaba. I ordered it, but unfortunately it probably won't be here in time for the holidays. But these are some things that I was able to find. The Super Wings Runway Connected Tower, which will work with all of her new to all of her current two-inch figures. The Super Wings 3-in-1 Build It Buddies playset with the special edition Donnie. With this, she gets a new Donnie dressed up as a Build It Buddy, which is amazingly adorable. And the Super Wings Rescue Riders vehicle. It is so large that now she can plan fun rescues with her sister. All right, now we have made it to Barbie. And I admittedly have been waiting excitedly until they turn three so that they could finally have them. Barbie was my favorite toy growing up. And fun elders and fun story. Um, my older brother actually broke my Barbie camper and I went after him with a steak knife. I will let you imagine the rest, but back to business. We begin with the Barbie Dreamhouse Adventures helicopter in pink and blue with a spinning rotor. This is amazingly cute. It is so detailed. It hasn't shipped yet, but I'll include some pictures. I really wanted the large plane, but I couldn't fit it into the budget. So uh, Barbie, if you guys are listening, you can feel free to send that. The helicopter was so amazing that I am still really happy with it. Next is the boxer Barbie and the fashion Barbie. My goal for each of my twins was to have a doll that looks like them. I love that Barbie now offers so many diverse options. And of course, we needed a little one. And the Chelsea Sweet Orchard Farm is adorable. She comes with a cute little chick and I love her big curly hair. Barbie always has a sweet ride, so I got a different car for each of my twins. First, the purple Jeep for Enzi and the pink Corvette for Yomi so they can both ride in style. Finally, after all that fun, Barbie needs to relax. So I found the Barbie pool playset to lounge after a hard day of being fabulous. Yes, I know this is not Barbie, but we needed J-Hope from BTS. My girls are mixed with Koreans and love K-pop music, so we had to throw that in there. Okay, now, after quarantine began, the girls were introduced to Disney Frozen movie when we got Disney+. Plus. They watched one Frozen movie, and now they watch every Frozen movie short video every single day. They even do their own impromptu musicals. So we got a few Disney Frozen toys to help them expand their current passion. Here we go! 
the Disney Frozen Find My Nose 14 inch Olaf plush. I mean, Olaf is life. 2020 will all make sense when I'm older, right? Now they can help him find his perfect nose. Disney's Anna Frozen 2 styling head. Yumi loves to do my hair, so I'm hoping she will take my place as the new hairstylist person. Disney Frozen 2's and accessories to match the dress and Disney Frozen 2 Bluetooth karaoke microphone. This can be attached via Bluetooth to their iPads so they can add lights and sounds to their musicals. Disney's Frozen 2 Elsa's Enchanted Ice Vanity. Because if you're going to dress up as a princess, you need to make sure your look is on point. This is still on the way, but I think it will be a hit. Disney's Frozen set Elsa and Anna dolls with Queen and Duna doll. I hope I said that right. And Olaf toy. The girl's grandmother is getting the larger dolls and they love playing mommy and baby so I thought this would be a cute addition. Frozen 2's BFF Elsa and Anna faux hair braid elastic pony set. Another great addition to the pretend and dress up options and you know who doesn't love a good clip in? Up next, the board games. A great way to get our family together and we try to pick some fun learning games as well. First up, the Hasbro Connect 4 Classic of course. Helps with dexterity, color, and counting, but it's fun for us. The learning, resources, sight, word, SWAT, and sight, <laughs> SWAT, a sight, word game, sorry. That's a hard tongue twister. The girls are a little young for this, but we can start using it for color and just say the word so that they can start connecting them together. Finally, this amazingly cute game that has a book option to go with it. This adorable game comes with a little squirrel that you squeeze his tail to pick up the colorful air corns and it is so fun. And of course, everything so far is linked below to help you find them for your little ones. Now to the world of Nintendo. Enzi is a beast at Super Mario Run on the iPad. At three years old, she's already fallen in love with everything Mario, so we had to get some Mario. First up, my favorite, the Super the Nintendo Super Mario Deluxe Mushroom Kingdom Castle playset with accessories. It includes Mario, Luigi, Princess Peach, and Bowser. A great way to bring her love of Mario into the real world. And who else is looking forward to the opening of new, uh, Nintendo Super Mario Land? I believe it's opening in Japan soon. I can't wait. Nintendo Super Mario Brothers Mario and Luigi costumes. More dress up, I know. But now the girls can be Mario and Luigi beating King Koopa. Super Mario Brothers, Baby Mario, and Baby Luigi plush set. I thought these were cute, but this is another item that is currently delayed. And for tougher levels, a body double Mario. The world of Mar Nintendo Mario Jumbo plush. And they needed someone to save, so of course, the little buddy Super Mario All-Star Collection Peach Stuff Animal plush. Sorry, not animals. Peach Stuff plush. If you haven't watched it yet, I highly recommend Star Wars The Mandalorian. This Star Wars, the Mandalorian 11 inch plush doll is probably going to be mine, but the girls can hold them sometimes too. Now, the finale, the big surprise. It's actually so large, I can't bring it in the house until Christmas Eve and they fall asleep. The elves will be up all night working on this one. It's the Kidcraft Treehouse Retreat Mansion. I purchased this at Costco. It is a five foot tall, four level dial house with lights and sounds, 13 rooms of play with a transparent elevator. It comes with 26 pieces, including a flushing toilet. Of course, I can't put it together yet, so check out these pics. Since it's not sold online, I included a similar one below, but it is so beautiful. Plus, all those Barbie toys and some of the other toys will actually pair perfectly with this for hours of play. So, did you guess the big surprise? What was your favorite toy? If you like this video, smush that thumbs up button. Like and share this video with your friends and family. And thank you for joining us today. Stay safe and whatever you celebrate, we hope you have a happy and joyous holiday. Bye friends.